welcome back to my channel and this is the last installment of our road trip through Europe. Last stops were Germany in Munster and Bruges. Hi guys, thank you for coming back to my channel. If you're new here, please make sure that you subscribe. If you are returning, thank you so much. It means the world to have you here. And of course, if you enjoy this video, make sure you give it a little thumbs up. So in summary, guys, I thought I'd show you on the map where our road trip was. So this is our final leg in this video, but in video number one, we started here in London, drove down to Folkestone, took the Eurotunnel across to France, drove through France, Belgium, and then had a stay up here in Swalle in uh, Netherlands. From Netherlands, we drove up to Lübeck here in Germany, where we also stayed. This was in road trip video number two. We then took a ferry crossing to Denmark here and stayed on Lolland, this island uh, down here. Um, which was in road trip video number two. Drove up to the coastline, Hunestel, and then further along we took the ferry across to Jutland, which is the main part of Denmark bordering up to Germany. And we stayed up here in North Jutland in Olberg. On our return leg in this video, road trip number three, we drove back through Denmark down to the south, through Germany, and then across to Münster over here. And then we continued through Holland, Belgium, and over to Bruges in Belgium, where we did our last stop. And then we drove back, took the Eurotunnel again from France to the UK, ending home in London town. So the last leg of our Europe trip was a, a stop in Münster in Germany. It was quite a long um, trip from Denmark to Münster uh, because of the traffic. Um, Hamburg in particular can be a bit of a, a melting pot to get through. It's where all of the traffic comes from both north and south, um, east and west. So um, yeah, that it can be quite um, quite congested, um, and it did take us a while to get through. Um, so I think from Denmark to Münster it took about nine hours. So that was a bit of a, a long trip. So we were really happy when we finally arrived at our lovely hotel and destination. Um, and I will show you around.
is the room, guys. This is where we're staying. Let's look at the view. Let's see if we can see something here. Look, nice view. How misty it is. Autumn day. Last stop on our Europe holiday road trip was Bruges. We have been to Bruges before and we enjoyed it so much that we thought, well, it's a perfect place to stop. Um, so this was our final stopover in Bruges and we had picked a lovely hotel, which was very close to the canals and uh, really handy for exploring the city when you are just there for a short period of time. I'll show you around our hotel and um, there will be a few clips from Bruges too. I hope you enjoy this part of the video uh, and our last leg of the road trip. So we arrived in the very pretty Bruges and it is just a lovely place to visit. It has got a lot of canals, cobbled streets, medieval buildings, the architecture is just fantastic and it's walkable. So it is a lovely place to visit and enjoy, sit down on a square, have a beer from Belgium maybe, enjoy a bit of chocolate uh, and go and do a bit of craft shopping. They are well known for lace making in Bruges too. So yeah, that's a little bit for everybody. Absolutely love it there. So as this was our second time in Bruges, we thought we would uh, go on one of the lovely boat trips that takes you around Bruges on the canals. The trip was fantastic, we really enjoyed it. The only downfall I would say is that there was quite a bit of a queue before getting onto the boat, but that didn't deter us and we thoroughly enjoyed it and highly recommend, if you go to Bruges, go on a boat trip too.
Net voor de brug zien we links het oude sint jans hospitaal waar de meestal stervende patiënten konden vanuit hun bed de heilige mis volgen. So we did do a little bit of chocolate shopping. What about a chocolate handbag? Chocolate high heels? Chocolate lipstick? You could get any kind of chocolate you wanted in Bruges. Yeah, absolutely mecca for chocolate. And we did buy some chocolatey presents to enjoy. So guys, we have arrived at Bruges and this is our room. There you go, nice double bed. It's rather swanky, isn't it? Nice big room, sofa, fireplace, nice chair. And over here, we've got like a little bureau so you can see here the hotel is called The Pand and outside we're just on the actual road here you can see just out there and just to the left of us are the Bruges canals so there you go that's the bed that's the room and then in here we have our bathroom nice bathtub hello guys that's me uh, and in here there's a shower isn't that lovely guys i love it and look nice products nice products here and have you seen this beauty guys it's a original antique goyard trunk look at this look at that wood and here you've got the goya print and then inside wowzers i would love to have this in our house there you go there's the original label how incredible is that just a shame we can't take it with us Goyot trunk at the end of our bed. Thank you so much for watching everybody i hope you enjoyed our little road trip across europe that it gave you some ideas of um, where you might want to stop if you do something similar maybe it gave you the idea to get in a car and just explore europe it's so accessible um, and easy to get around and see some new places um, so I can highly recommend it is a lovely way of traveling um, you are free from any kind of time constraints and you can stop where you want and you can also do as much shopping as you like um, because you can 
just put it in your car and you're not constrained by um, plane restrictions and so on. So yes, really recommend it. Um, and I hope you enjoyed it. I will, of course, share future travel with you guys when we go somewhere, even if it's a short trip uh, in the UK. I hope you enjoy it. And if you do, make sure you give it that thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I would really appreciate if you could. Um, it will help me grow our little channel here and um, you will also get notified when I put out a new video. So thank you so much and have a fantastic day.